Hello, you guys. Welcome back to All Things Jennifer. Today, I have a great video for you guys. You can tell by the title what this video is going to be about. And everyone has been asking for another story time. So, get ready, you guys. We are going to talk about it. Are you guys ready? So, hopefully, this will help you in your business to not, you know, help you with some mistakes. That's what story time is for. So stick around. So welcome back, my gym friends. I hope you guys all are doing well. You guys, I want to thank you for all the love and the support. Um, it has been amazing here. We're almost at a thousand subscribers. Thank you guys so very much. Um, I have been getting several emails. Uh, if you go onto the community uh, post on YouTube, you will know I get a lot of feedback on there. You guys wanted a story time, so I said, let me do this story time. So, you guys, also, I would like to say, welcome back, my newbies. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are new here, then subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell so you can know when I drop a video. It is amazing over here. If you are a oldie, but you definitely a goodie, I thank you so much for the continued love and support. You guys, um, we're gonna get into this story time because baby, we 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 just gotta we just gotta talk about it. This is one story time. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, this made me upset. Um, so I sell luxury charms on my, um, website. You guys already know that my luxury charms are one of the popular, uh, things on my site. Um, so I saw my inventory was getting low. Well, someone placed the order for 200 and I think 50 luxury charms. You guys, I didn't know that I was, because you never know. You could be sleep. That's why I say always be ready. Um, don't wait and purchase your items because you don't know if you get the order while you sleep. You don't know if you get the order while you're out of town, you're sick, whatever the case may be. The show must continue to go on, okay? So, you guys, I had enough to cover her, but I think I needed like 20 or 13 pieces or so. So, you guys, I already had order luxury charms from my vendor. But the thing of it was, I had just recently did it. My vendor ships in about a week, in about two days at the most. Um, thank God for that. I have a quick vendor. Okay, you guys, so lo and behold, I get this order. I wake up in the morning, and I'm like, uh, I don't think I have that amount. So I was like, I'm not finna just give her anything or anything like that. So I correspond with her and send a message, and I was like, you know what? Um, I don't have the 250, but I do have two something. And she was like, oh, that's fine. Can you send me the other later? Because I really need it bad. I said, yeah, sure. So I went to, uh, went online and went to a group to purchase some Lux. And uh, this person was selling, having a sale, and it was like dollars and some cents. Um, but you could tell that this person was trying to get rid of them because every day it was the same sale. So uh, apparently, she was trying to get rid of them. Lo and behold, you guys, um, and I normally purchase from vendors just because I don't want to have problems. So, and I like my standards are high, I guess, because when I purchased from her, I was like, oh, you seen the video, um, and you was, I was like, oh, well, they look good, you know, no issue or anything like that. So, um, I got her charms, and they came in the mail. First of all, they came in a Halloween bag. That was the first 
It is not Halloween. We are in summer. It was like July, I think. Yeah, because we're in August right now. That happened in July. So, my girl, um, she comes in. She was already in the house. And she was like, oh, I see you got your locks. She has, uh, I think, just got off of work, I think. And I had the bag on the countertop. And I didn't say anything, you guys. I was like, because maybe I'm, you know, being extra. So, I was like, I'm not going to say anything about the locks. I'm going to see what she says. And she's like, why is they in this type of bag? I was like, you know, some people, um, what I want to say, presentation, they don't care about that. They're All they care about, you getting the item, they getting their money, whatever the case. Which, okay, we're fine with that. We're in October, I guess. July is in October, you guys. So, nonetheless, so my girl, she looks and she's like, oh, they look different. And I was like, I'm not going to say, I'm still not going to say anything. Um, so she do a test. My baby is smart. She do, does a test and she takes one of my looks that I had and one of uh, the girl looks. And she takes it and put it on our uh, countertop, like granite countertops. So she drops it on there you guys and i was like oh my baby is smart because i already had did that but i didn't tell her i did it and she was like they sound different what is wrong with these looks and she's like you just got scammed and i was like well i can't say at least i got them you know whatever so i'm gonna show them to you too you guys so she drops them, and i was like yeah and she was like what you thinking? And I was like, nothing. You tell me what you think. She said, they're horrible. They're trashed. So, this is the type of looks I got. Couldn't even sell it, you guys, to no one because I know my customers know that's another thing you guys got to think about. When you try to half ass, you just lost that customer because if I was to send her this, She'll be like, what am I going to do with this? I'm going to tell you guys what I did. Look at this compared to my locks. This is one. I'm going to show you guys another one. This is another one. This is another one. And I'm like, where is this little Chrissy Crossy thing coming from? I never saw this before. So... And that was some other ones. They were like gold and silver all over. And I guess because it got a little bling, that's it. But hit those things on the countertop and they sound like, I don't know, like some plastic or something. It, it just sound cringing. It didn't sound like looks like your regular looks. So she was like, what are you going to do? And I was like, I can't sell them to her. That's for sure. So, what I did was, I was like, I was like, I'm so sorry, I'm going to give you a free gift. Um, I will add this, I will add a couple of freebies to your order. And she said, oh, thank you so much. Um, I also sent her patches and I think fabric as well. Um, I think two patches and two fabrics is what I, cause I always try to do a double, not one. Um, so, you guys, um... I didn't contact this person. I just took it as an L. Uh, but it showed me, I was like, my standards are way too high. I will not support nobody on their group or, you know, whatever the case. So, you guys, um, she was selling them. I think it was like a dollar or a dollar in some sense, something like that. Got them, and I was like disappointed. I made a whole Facebook post about them and everything. And I was just like, this is not it. Because you got to think about it. When you sell them to your customer, your customer may pay in two, three, a hundred and something, whatever that price may be, you want their lux to shine on whatever they're about to put it on. Crocs, a watch, a bag, whatever it may be. So I was like, OMG, I cannot believe this, you guys. I like got 
bamboozled. So, um, I said, this look like she made it in her basement or something. It was just, just horrible. I mean, if even if you guys feel it, you can look on the back. Like, it looks bad. Look at that. And what I did to fix the situation, I gave them away for free. That was a lot of people that ordered around that time. And I was like, you know what? I normally send out freebies. So I was like, I'm going to give them five. I'm going to give this person two. I'm going to give this person three. I'm going to give this person whatever. And nobody didn't know what I was doing. That's being professional. I'm not going to go and attack her because you got to think about it. Her business is ran totally different from my business. I take pride in my business. I take pride in every item, patches. You guys definitely want to stick around because I got some news to tell you. So keep watching this video. Um, but I take pride in everything that I have. Some people are like, I'm not spending that amount on paper. I'm not spending that amount on this. What? You're making the money, so why you're not spending the money? I know why. Because you're taking advantage of your customer. If you charging $200, $100, or whatever the case for a pair of Crocs, she should get the baddest Crocs that you can do. Sorry. That's how I feel. If that just say, for instance, if you consume food, you want the best service possible. You want good food. Your vibrations come from your food. If you're angry, don't cook. Go buy go, go buy something. Why? That negative energy is going along with your food. That's how I feel, you guys. So I take pride in my work. I take. Like, you guys don't understand. Behind the scenes, I'm always working. I'm always looking for ways to better my business. Um, so that's to say, be careful when you buy things from people, these groups, or whatever the case may be. Because sometimes what you see is not what it is. So, you guys, um, that's the reason why I stopped supporting people. Um, because I have got burned so far twice. There won't be a third. Um, not if I can help it. Um, they say the people, you know, overseas, it take a long time. I really take a long time. But mine does not, do not. Um, I've been with her for ever since I opened. So, she made sure she get my stuff here on time. If I have an issue, I let her know and she fix it. So, you guys, let's get on from that. But I had to tell you guys that story because you guys asked for a story time. I do got more. Um, that I can tell you, yeah. So I'm a little bit messier than others. Um, uh, but I do got new looks in, you guys. Um, I make sure I kind of stop stock up. I actually am ordering more because it's, it's going as fast as I can put it out there. Um, so I'm going to um actually order more. Or I think it's Friday. No, I got a busy day Friday, uh, Thursday, because my husband got to take his car to get service. And I'm going with him, and we got a date. So, I won't be going Thursday. So, put your smiley face on. We got right now, you guys, Crocs for $22 on the website, 623rd.com. Here they go. This is a red pair right here. And they're going to tag. And I'm going to take them out the bag so y'all can see them. It's red, black. I only got one light blue, I think, left in this box. But I got another one coming. I wish I would show y'all the box. But I will put up the picture to show you guys. So... This is a size, let me see what size, and they're different sizes. This is size women's nine. Here they go for $22, y'all, $22. 
So there's several on the website. You better get them while they're there. 22. 22. Crocs is not selling you no Crocs for no $22. I'll show you the back as well. Never been worn. Brand new in the bag, baby. $22. I don't know if y'all going to be able to get the bag because to ship them out. I know I'm putting them in uh, priority, uh, but you will get your tag. But $22 on the website. I told y'all I was coming through. And they are now playing your little shipping, whatever your zip code is. And mm, you got some new Crocs, girl. Uh -huh. Oh, my gosh. Because I got black as well. I got um, red. I got, um, let me show you the blue. I got some more coming. But here's the blue. Ooh, boy. Like, these are right here. I was just like, but I already got a pair. And they're my size. Women's eight. So, y'all better go cop them Crocs, okay? I thank you guys so much for your love and your support. And you guys already know what it is. Until next time, you guys. Stay fabulous. Bye.